Hey, and welcome back to uh, more Fallout. I haven't done one of these in a while because I had to redo my streaming setup. That was fun. I was trying to get video capture working for my Switch, and it didn't, and I messed everything up in the process. So, <laughs> yeah. Well, today we are going to continue on the quest uh, that uh, uh, whoever it is up in this tower has set us to do. However, first, I want to go take a look at the camp because I actually just rebuilt it. Last time I did a stream, I built a camp here, and I wasn't really happy with it, so I said I was going to do something offline. I did. I made a video of that. Uh, wasn't happy with that either. And then a new prefab came out that I really, really like. The uh, Fire Watchtower. So I built the camp up around a Fire Watchtower. Sounds like we got a key code officer around somewhere. I kept the um, basic cage for my power, water, scrap generation. But, yeah, got a whole new thing built up around this watchtower. Uh, the punji boards are just to help stop uh, enemies from running in. Uh, sorry, board with nails through it. The game calls them punji boards. Did I see something down there? Eh, I'm not going to worry about it. So, yeah, let's just take a quick look around. So, like I said, this hasn't changed. It's just... Uh, Scrap collection, water, power, stuff like that. Previously, I had all my crafting out here. Um, most attacks tend to come from this direction. And they'll probably try to come up these stairs, so i got my guns out protecting this area. But let's take a look at this tower. Uh, yeah. Hey, buddy. So, let's start with... It. Yeah, it does that sometimes. Start with it's just a little sitting area, and then at the bottom of the tower, just all my crafting. Uh, once the quest is done, I can even fit a uh, power armor station in here if I need to. And at the top, I just got a basic living area. I figure a, a hammock. I'd actually like a cot better, but the cot that's in this game is actually not really a cot. It's weird because they do have a proper cot model. But what they call a cot is actually just a bed with a military blanket on it. Oh well. And yeah, I quite like this. Uh, I quite like this tower. Uh, be nice if we can get one without the windows being all broken up, but it's fine. It's a really nice view. Kind of cool. I th I think the makeshift mansion is still my favorite prefab, but I'm, I'm really quite taken with this uh, Firewatch tower. And I had some fun getting the uh, adding the walls to it because the walls don't snap to this floor here; they snap to these floors here. But that's enough of that. Let's continue on our quest. Close all the doors. I might replace that door because that red rocket door behaves strangely. take one of those so my food and uh, drink are full up and start that counter for getting another one since we are going up here figure we'll follow the tracks for well you would know I think we'll go down the hill this way which is probably going to be remarkably dangerous now that I think about it well let's see what happens What weapon do I have? Let's get to the bow. Ooh. Uh, let's um go back and see if I have the stuff needed to repair that rifle. Because having that break on us would be bad. Oh yeah, I don't have a ton of stamina on this character. <laughs> Yeah, let's repair this. Um, that button. Okay, good. I can. Actually, can I do... Can I give it a stock yet? Um, where'd it go? There it is. I can. 
can't. Oh, I can give it a true stock. That is surprising. Yeah, I'll take that. Nice. Okay. Now we're going to move on. Yeah, I'm definitely going to replace that door, but not right now. It's fine for now. Soon we'll be able to continue the um, settler storyline. Um, settlers? I don't remember. <laughs> the first expansion. I did kill one of those keycard officers off stream because it was annoying me when I was working. Well, I was working on the house, but uh, there might be another one around. Come on. Ah, oh, heck. Where did that shot come from? Oh, from this 40th level person. Oh, that's bad. I don't know. I'm not going to complain, but I don't know why they're not doing more damage to me. There's the damage. <laughs> take the hardened mass too to be honest anyway we should just do it this way yeah take everything deal with it sort it out later <clears throat> uh, hmm. do I have any purified water on me or anything that I can use to heal yeah I have some There we go. Don't want to use some of our precious healing kits unless we need to. Uh, let's see. I got turned around. <laughs> I'm heading back towards uh, the camp. I say, I didn't think we were supposed to be bumping into a road quite yet. this mess if we can. So in my test recording, I did notice the, uh... Oh, that's bad. So I ran towards it. Brilliant. Oh, yeah, that was really, really dumb. Okay, well, let's just respawn back at camp and then come back. So I was saying, in my test recording, I did notice that the face cam was being a bit weird. If it continues to do that, I might uh, stop using the face cam. That sounds like my camp is under attack. Oh, it definitely was. Some of my stuff took damage. Yeah, the gate took a took some damage. it was. I guess my turrets took care of it. 
That's good. Now we're just going to quickly scrap some of these guns we picked up. Oh, that's bad. Oh, liberators. They're annoying. Okay, hopefully that's the last one. Luckily, enemies don't jump. <laughs> Otherwise, that fence would do nothing. Well, when we can eventually use a combat shotgun, we'll have some nice mods for it. Take two. This time I'm going to try to run away from mines rather than towards them. And we'll probably move our tent at some point as well. No reason to leave it there with a camp just on the other side of the train. Yeah, that definitely sounds like there's another uh, nuclear key code officer around somewhere. I thought there'd be something up there. I don't feel like fighting it, though. Ooh, that was a lag spike. That was unpleasant. We do have a, a level to spend later. As we get into 20th level, I think that's when the stealth perks unlock, so our stealth will get better at that point. Oh, you're kidding me. Okay, where's our stuff? Might not have had anything actually. Uh, oh no, I had yeah, I had some scrap. Now, I believe there's a way down here somewhere. Kind of looks like there should be. I think it's following a ski lift to get down. I thought there was a ski lift to follow to get down. Maybe I'm wrong. Okay, well, we do it the interesting way and hope I don't fall to my death. <laughs> Just keep following this edge for now. There's a pathway down there. Oh. The edge of a cliff is not where I want to be with a lag spike. And I'm heading right towards a bunch of raiders. Awesome. Uh, okay, I don't need to go towards the raiders, though. If I can go this way. Let's not run full steam right off the edge of a cliff. I think I need to go a little bit this direction in order to get down. Oh, there's this ski lift I was supposed to follow. Alright, no big deal.
Okay, I, we don't need this uh, marker anymore. There we go. Remove marker. Okay. This is probably how you're supposed to get up to top of the world for the first time. I've just always done it the difficult way. <laughs> Am I going down too far? No, I th think we're okay. Actually, where's that roadway? Oh, we're not going to get that anytime soon. Oh, yeah. Just wondering if there's a quicker way to get to the road. Oh, that is a death claw, and uh, that's a glowing death claw that's very high level. Uh, I don't care. We're we're not doing that. I think uh, I think we go through the raider camp instead. Sixtieth <laughs> level glowing death claw. I don't think so with an 18th level character. No way. I mean, part of me wants to snipe it a bit just so I can get some experience from one of them. Okay, well, I hit that. Yeah, you know what? Let's be cheeky about it, but we're going to try and kill the uh, Deathclaw first, because... I honestly I think the Deathclaw is going to win that fight if it left to its own devices anyways. Oh, heck yeah, the Deathclaw won the fight, and now I think it's coming for us. Danger. Yeah, it knows we're here. Oh good, the fight's not over. Okay. How is that sentry bot doing down there? It might be dead and that death claw is coming for us. Nope. Uh get out of that please. Thank you. Oh, this was such a bad idea. I know it's in that direction because it's on my bar, but I can't see it. I don't even see the remains of the robot to loot. Okay, well, let's... Uh Maybe it'll forget about us. <laughs> that was such a bad idea. Uh, do I have to be up there? No, I think I don't think we do. I think if we go this way, we'll find that pathway. Oh, hey, an acid node. Leave this the road I want. Yeah. Uh, well, not taking a shortcut, so. I don't know if this is another nuclear plant you can power up. I know at the other two there's uh, like an event that triggers when you get close enough. Yep, there sure is. I'm not doing it. Attention customers. Soloing that. Power plant has experienced an unexpected failure. We apologize. 
apologize for the yeah. inconvenience. Rest assured that our maintenance crews are working hard to minimize the outage and safely restore power. Based yes. on current projections, most customers should expect power to be restored by... Hmm. <laughs> Soloing that would be miserable, if possible at all. Oh, rad storm. That's awesome. At least I think... Yep, that's a rad storm. Yeah, it's okay. We we heal radiation damage. Now, would it be better to go off road or eh, just follow the path? Should be fine. Wonderful weather. Okay, there's definitely unpleasant stuff for us to deal with here. Wow, that, speaking of unpleasant, that flickering. Ooh. Uh, yes, I'm getting above it on purpose. I want to be able to look down. And nothing unpleasant here. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, uh, get at the sniper rifle and see what we can do. And what are they off fighting? Oh! Giant bloody bear. A 45th level. Oh. Yeah, we're definitely working on the bear. Well, we're not sneak attacking anymore. Oh, please don't come up here. Looks like the rat storm's clearing, I think. We do need to find and deal with that bear, though, preferably from up here. I was not expecting a giant irradiated bear. Expecting a honey beast would also be really unpleasant, but it wouldn't be a giant irradiated bear. I know you're still around here somewhere. Good news is if we die, we can fast travel back. Why is it blue? This is the quantum weather or whatever it is? I'll take all of those things. Oh, there's the, uh... Wow. That sucked. There we go. What we're after should be on one of two bodies. If it's not on one, it should be on the other. Here we go. Oh, 
Uh, this schematic should be pretty self-explanatory, even to someone with any expertise. With electronics needs specialized parts. Uh, yeah, that might be fun to get. The array, the array is a government facility, so they had pretty good equipment specs. Yada yada yada. Okay, let's just take that and the whoop the schematics. Now we need to go get the two specialized parts, which are where. Oh, that's I know what that is. That's. Oh, both of those are going to be deeply unpleasant. <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> okay, let's get to it. Okay, let's try to sneak past the, the bandits here. Usually one of them in power armor in there, and I don't feel like messing with them. Of course, I might not have much choice. Yeah, I'm sure me jumping over that bloody rock was real subtle. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I know what that is. Oh, that is going to hurt. Yeah, oh, sorry about that. Hand twitched. Yeah, that sure, sure looks like the crash up there. Must be a settler or something. Chopping wood in the area. Look at all these glowing nuclear plants. That's why it was so hard for me to get... Uh, I think it was a tato or something like that I needed. They're all irradiated. <laughs> so they're all turning into something else. Yeah, this is what I thought it was. So there's a bunch of robots in here. go. Okay, the fastest way to get there is probably from Helvetia. Let's I have some scrap on me, I think, so let's get rid of that. Having some uh, troubles there, buddy. <laughs> the uh, punchy board does give the robo dog a little bit of trouble. I think that's why it's behaving that way, but. Yeah. Whoops, left my door open. Closed a curtain, but left the door open. Ah, uh, right, we're not scrapping that. We're putting that in there. And did we have any guns to scrap? Oh, yeah. Ah, 
Actually, we're just going to fast travel again. Yeah, it's fast travel to Helvetia and then cross the river. Yeah, we need to go up there. Honestly, kind of stunned we got away from... We got that last quest object without having to fight a bunch of robots. We are not going to be as lucky this time. This time it's super mutants and there's a lot of them. I was hoping there won't be too many super high level irradiated ones. What? We should find a spot to drop our tent when we get a little closer. So we have a re uh, like a more convenient respawn point. I'm hoping going this way will let me get up there. It looks like it will. Oh, good. Uh, let's put our survival tent here for now. Yeah, that's what I mean. There is a model for an actual cot in the game, but the the military cot blueprint that you can find doesn't look like this. It looks like a bed. It has always annoyed me. I really want that cot as something I can build in my camps. Actually... I think we're going to try and, oh, no, that's a shotgun. I think we're going to try and do some distance sniping here. Try and make it so our odds aren't complete and utter trash. Uh, can I get there from here? Yes. Yeah, because this is part of the crash plan that they're living in. I mean, this was an ambitious, uh, like, place to live that some someone set up, some survivors set up. Now, it's overrun with super mutants, but it was definitely ambitious. Because it's not like the plane broke apart in the power pylon. It would have destroyed it. Uh, people would have had to haul that up there and make that. Kind of makes you wonder what was down on the ground. Probably scorched, honestly. Ah, 40th level. This will be fun. Yeah, they're shooting blind. That doesn't mean they can't hit, though. to hit it in the head. Oh, look, a laser gun. Those are uh, getting buffed soon. I say buffed. They're fixing a bug that's been in the game since launch. They're not doing enough damage. Apparently the energy damage calculation has never been functioning properly and they finally fixed it.
There is a bit of... Got it. Without touching the mic. There was a bit of fuzz that was annoying me. Okay, let's see if we can deal with the super mutant. Oh, I got... That couldn't have been the same 40th level I was shooting at. Uh, are they all 40th? I'm pretty sure, actually, I'm pretty sure that one I one-shotted was... I didn't catch its health bar. I'll have to look at it later. Ah. Oh, I don't like that I can hear it talking. I mean, yeah, there's no suppressor on this rifle, so you probably hear a lot of really loud bangs. It was just the wind throwing small bits of lead really, really fast. I need to get up there. So we don't necessarily need to get clear of that, but I don't trust my ability to sneak past 40th level super mutants. Well, let's see what happens. Oh! Well, at least it's only 18. Darn, I missed. Where are you? Uh, 40. Oh. That was a good hit. Oh good, I one shot that. Okay, back up. They know where I am now. Oh, good. They lost me. Ah! Am I hitting terrain? I thought that was lined up. It probably was because I'm bad at this. But I thought it was lined up. Yeah, let's, uh, let's live dangerously. Oh, well, at least it's low level. That didn't kill it. That did. No, oh, hey, guess who forgot to silence their phone again? Uh, I should check that. I apologize. Sorry about that, that was work related. You have to come out sooner or later. Oh good, that one's 18th level, I think. I'm gonna ignore you for now, because you probably won't one-shot me. Probably. since they see me anyways. Please draw the bow, or just die. Oh, I'm still gonna die. Yep, they do. Running away now.
Damn. <laughs> oh, that was the wrong button. I jumped while stealthing and zooming in with a rifle. That would be immensely disorientating. Nope, they can see me and hit me just fine. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Oh, wow. They did lose me. I think that was gonna work. I honestly don't know how many diluted stim pats I have left. I should check on that. I know we don't have a lot. How many of these do I have? Four. Okay. I might need to use one in a bit. Come on. Won't take me any more hits to finish you. Ah! Now, I don't think I need to go far this way to get back up there. If we've cleared this place, I'm going to loot that that tower. There's probably some like salvage and whatnot, and I want their guns to scrap. I believe I heard another super mutant or two up here, though. Alright, we went a bit too high, but that's fine. That means I can look down on the area. Oh, look. Oh, I thought I had a crit stored up. I don't. Now I do, but it's not worth using. There we go. Now, if we wanted, I can just fast travel from here, but I think, dirty water, I think we might have cleared that camp. Uh, no. Thank you for not being ridiculously high level. Ow, 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 ow. Well, that was sloppy, dropping down right next to one. <gasps> uh, okay, let's uh, see what we can have to eat and drink. Hmm. Don't like using a purified water like this, but we now actually have a supply of it. It's not too bad. Yeah, just give me all the things. Ooh, especially the stim pack. I think... Can I put my temp down here? Nah, I didn't think I'd be able to. Oh, well. Yeah, let's take a risk. Let's...
Yeah, that's not surprising. And I don't know if there's a crafting bench around here. Might be crafting bench in... in uh, might be crafting bench in one of these. Thought I saw something like that. Oh, look. <laughs> I'm laughing because you find a lot of those over the course of the game. Eleven bobby pins. It'd be really drafty sleeping up here. I mean, my camp is at the top of a fire watch tower. Uh, no, I'm not doing that. A fire watch tower that has busted windows, so, you know. Can't really... I don't really get to comment on the matter, but hey. It would be really drafty up there. Um... I don't recall seeing a crafting bench up above. Let's see if there's any one down here. If not, we're gonna have to walk back to the tent. Probably gonna have to hobble back to the tent. That's okay. Tent's not that far away. Yeah, let's start making our way back to the tent. It's not that far away. That was less painful than I thought that was going to be. I thought for sure we'd die, like, here for sure. And I figured the robots would get us at least once. That went really well. I hope my tent isn't up there. I mean, I can move the tent. Okay. Oh, wait, uh, I'm not be making those grenades. Let's get rid of that. There. And. I will scrap this stuff off screen. Okay, so, oh boy, how long, I really hope I didn't have that pit boy light on the whole time. I think I just had that while I was looting, I think. What does it I want us to do next? Uh, any tanker, well, I'm not using the one in there. Okay, well, let's go home and build this thing. Too far. This. And there should be a quest tab. Here we go. That's built. What do we need to do next? Go to the National Isolated Radio Array. Down there. 
So yeah, I think we're gonna do that next time. Uh, so yeah, I think this, this is where I'm gonna end off. Off screen, I'm just gonna scrap some stuff, maybe repair my gear, nothing serious. Uh, but yeah, I'll have this uh, edited and uploaded soon. I hope it was fun to watch. <laughs>